Hey guys, I'm Brother Dispatch. <laughs> this is HMK, and this is a new segment called Drunk HMKs. I, I remember. Ask HMK questions while he's drunk. And today's question is. Anyways, yeah, he's drunk a lot. Five beers, four shots, and he's like this. Light. I mean, yeah. Anyways. What did you try to say? The first question is. Can you, you, have you, to go, you have to go. You have to go off the camera for that. What? You have to go off. Anyways, camera. I'm. At, anyways, the first question for HMK is. What is the Keyblade? Explain it to the viewers. Ask one more time. What is a Keyblade from Kingdom Hearts? Okay, so the Keyblade, uh, the Keyblade is a sword, the main weapon from the game series Kingdom Hearts, which is a fucking amalgamation of Disney and Final Fantasy, I guess, made by Tetsu and Nomura. The Keyblade is a weapon wielded by Sora, Terra, Aqua, Ventus. Roxas, Shion, Kairi, Riku, and King Mickey, Master Zeno, Young Zeno, and, and Master Ericus. It is a key shape. Is a key shaped sword that usually has a blunt edge, so I don't understand why it's called a Keyblade. But it's a um, it's a Keyblade. They call it a Keyblade, but whatever. Um, it's. A sword that they use to fight the darkness or the light or whatever. They use it to kill the heartless and um, they use it to unlock worlds and unlock stuff. Unlock, it can unlock anything. I don't know what I'm saying. It, they can unlock anything. It can unlock treasure chests. It can unlock the rooms in between. It can unlock the door to the light, the door to the darkness, all that good jazz. The Keyblade was modeled after the X-Blade, which is the Keyblade, or the Kai-Blade, and, um... It can do a lot of shit. It can kill Heartless. It also acts as a home beacon, home and beacon for Heartless. Because the thing about the Keyblade, I mean, if it, even though it's used by Warriors of Light, it attracts the darkness. Which doesn't fucking make sense because, like, okay, yeah, I'm for the dark, I'm for the light, but I kill the darkness. But somehow the Keyblade acts as a beacon for the darkness and its fledgling, such as the Heartless. And whoever wields the Keyblade is in constant dark, is in constant darkness. No, constant, constant, um, constant threat of the Heartless. Danger, countless danger of the heartless. Yes, <laughs> it's in constant danger of the heartless because when you build the keyblade, the, the the darkness and the heartless will always come after you. The keyblade, even though it's a blunt object, and that one guy on YouTube says that oh, it's gonna be a terrible weapon. Um, fucking, do you have him a master sword? Uh, even though the keyblade is a I fucking. I can, but will. There's nails in that shit, please. Can, can I have it? Can you have it? May I please have it? Yes, you may. Thank you. Okay, so like, um, unlike the Master Sword, which has a fucking... Um, Why? No, you have to pull up the bed. There we go. Unlike the Master Sword, which I'm holding in my hand, which is the Legend of Zelda, my favorite series ever. Unlike the Master Sword, which actually has a fucking edge. It's unreal. <laughs> I'm sorry, even though it has a fucking edge, the Keyblade doesn't have an edge because a fucking Keyblade and it's it's fucking cylindrical and doesn't have an edge, it has a blunt, uh, it's a blunt object. But I theorize that the Keyblade has like an, like an, uh, a magical edge, you know what I mean? Like, it, it, like, even though it's a blunt object, it still cuts and shit. The reason why it cuts is because a magical edge made of light or darkness or whatever it's made out of projects right in front of the blunt object part of the keyblade and allows it to cut through the darkness and cut through enemies and shit and that's the end of the master sword segment if you could put that back in the scabbard that would be very very cool 
but that's what I theorize. But anyways, the Keyblade is the main weapon of the, key, of the Kingdom Hearts series. It allows you to open up anything, it allows you to fight the darkness, but it also allows you to fight against other people. But unlike the fucking Master Keeper and the Kingdom Keep... It, uh, other Keyblades such as Oath Keeper, Oblivion, and the Ultima Weapon... Ultima Weapon has a sharp edge and allows you to cut shit for real. So yeah, the the keyblade, um, the keyblade is awesome. Um, but um, it's funny that I love Kingdom Hearts and the keyblade because my dad's a locksmith, and um, when he first heard about the keyblade, I'm like, so bad, mijo. Is the, the the keyblade or and lock shields? Do we have keys that are blades and locks that are shields? I'm like, no, dad, we don't have that yet, yet. Well, that, 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 um, yeah, fucking Keyblade. So that's the Keyblade. Uh, the Keyblade cuts shit. Even though it doesn't have an edge. But it has an edge, in my theory, that it has an edge, like, in front of the blade. Of the supposed blade, but, uh, so it cuts through shit. And it's able, and it's able to open shit. Like, treasure chests and doors and... Realms in between the the heart of worlds and shit, and the Keyblade is also the basis of the Keyblade War, which fucked everything up, and that's why we have the Kingdom Hearts series, which is awesome, and I'm grateful for the Keyblade War, even though it fucked shit up. And um, there's no scabber. The Keyblade comes out to the person when he calls it, so he goes on ching like that. And the Keyblade is bound to its master, but of course it can choose its master because the Keyblade is also an, an uh, not omnipotent, but it's a, it's a being, I'm drunk, so I can't think of the word, you're going to probably leave it in the comments section below, but it's, it's a being that has its own thought patterns and can think for itself. So of course it can choose it's, it's own master. What? An intellectual? Not intellectual, but, um, but, 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 <laughs> ah, fuck! God damn it, I sit on my fucking thumb! Oh, Yo, ah! Okay. Fuck! Not intellectual. But it has it has the capacity to think. And there's a word for that, but I can't think of it. But it, it, it can think for itself and it can choose its master and it it, it, it it's bound to its master, so it, it bounds to its calling. But of course the keep they can be passed down to other people like come here, come here, come in the shop. Yes, the Kyrie. And the, 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 the 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 key the key blade inheritance are my way. I say I say take the in this hand take this key and one day, someday, your wielder you may be and then you hold the, the hilt, you fucking grab the hilt hilt, and then you become a keyblade wielder sometime in the future. So that's the keyblade summer. So you can choose this wielder and ship. There are keyblades of light and darkness and in between, but we've yet to see that shit. God damn, I really tried. Mm -hmm. But, um. Mm, I but, think you're done. No, I don't think I'm done. The keyblade. And then the keyblade! The keyblade! I think you're done. <laughs> I'm gonna try yeah, I'm done. So I believe this concludes uh, this episode of Drunk HMK. <laughs> I'm not drunk. Anyway. Uh, please, if you guys have any questions you would like to ask Drunk HMK, leave them in the comment segment and he's gone. Below, as HMK went down, below. If you have any questions for him that you'd like to answer in the future, go ahead and comment them below and we'll get to them. Uh, this has been Drunk HMK. And I'm Brother Dispatch. Oh, Don't forget to like and subscribe and you know, you know the drill. Bye guys. So you gonna get up now? <laughs>